Um, no. The bunny hood's over here. Now that we've gotten the Gabito mask, let's make our way over here. Put the bunny mask on. Bunny hood, not mask. God, you're so wrong, me. I like how whenever you walk away from the house, it fades out, but when you get close, it fades in. What do you want, Tattle? Uh, she's just probably telling us about this bloodlust or whatever. <laughs> oh, Tattle, there's nothing to be worried about. Hidden bloodlust. Oh, looky, we're on the bottom of a well. Something you never did in Ocarina of Time. Um, okay, you... There's... Uh, Gabito standing by the door. I think you need to put on the Gabito mask when you talk. There you go. Just put it on. And you can talk to them. Leave it. Leave it. Leave me something delicious to chomp on. Oh, yeah. We're supposed to go back and get stuff. Alright, here we go. We need to leave. I don't think we can just fly straight. Yeah, let's at least walk out here. Then I think I'll let us fly, fly away because we're outside still. Yeah, there we go. Um... This is the part I was talking about earlier, the trade se trade sequence. Texan accent popping out at random intervals. Um, yeah, the trade sequence thing that I was talking about. You grab item, the items I listed earlier, being, being, uh, what were they? Milk, fish, bombs... Deku nuts and magic beans. Uh, you need those to get through the little area, or else you can't progress very far. I think the actual area itself might have a few places where you can go and grab what you need. But we're just going to take the easy route and come with stuff. Oh, good. I was about to say, are we going to walk in on the aliens? Oh, I've never thought about that. Or, actually, I might have thought about that before in a past episode. I don't remember. But I've, I've never actually done that where you walk in on a uh, alien attack. That'd be really interesting. I'm going to have to try that out for one of those extra episode things I was talking about. Um, I'll explain that in just a second. Here we go. Moo! Nice music! It reminds me of the pasture, a.k.a. outside. That song just wants me to let go. Put out a lot of milk. And then she moans for you. But I always thought that was really weird, the way the cow has um, that girl moan that they have. Really weird, but pretty funny. It's just like, moo, moo, moan. Fucking cows. What a fucking cows. Uh, mutter, m utter fucking, oh my god. I'm the worst human being. <laughs> the Cardboard Lawyer Acapella Majora's Mask soundtrack will be out never. Because that'd be a terrible idea. Deku Baba. Deku Berber. I don't know all their names. They're just Deku monsters. Horrible, horrible Deku monsters. Not our... Friendly Deku monsters. <laughs> I like how it's just like speciesism is just present in this game. The Dekus who won't sell you stuff unless you're a Deku or a Goron or a Zora or whatever. Other things like that. People who won't serve you because you're a Deku. It's random little things like that. I know it's awful, but it's a nice touch in a game. Like, um... Apparently Mass Effect 2, you get a phone or something, and you, you'll get like texts or emails, I don't know, I haven't played the game. Apparently you can get spam. Like, while, while that's just a little thing, I think that's a really nice touch. I like nice touches in video games. Cause nice touches are nice! There we go, five magic beams. Five whole things that we normally don't need. I actually use the magic beam. Quite a few times in this game. It's kind of weird. What the fuck was that? I played the song correctly. Jeez. It's so weird playing it on a D-pad rather than the C buttons. Because it's... I don't know. I don't know. 
It's like trying to do a move in Street Fighter instead of playing a song to a quarter turn. I should try that. Well, I guess that would only work on ones that are connected. Hmm. Ah, well. We got what we, we needed. Back into Beneath the Well. Is that what it's called in this game? I think Beneath the Wells in the other one is what the other one's called. Maybe this one's also Beneath the Well. Hmm. I pond. Scratching where my beard would be if I hadn't shaved. Well, not beard, like one of those big fucking ZZ Top beards, but, you know, beard thingy beneath the well. Okay, there we go. Now we can. Actually, wait. How much? What's over here? Oh, there's another Gabito over there. Gabito, give me the same thing. Leave it, leave it, leave me something delicious to chop on. And this is where we give him our motherfucking beans. And I think he eats all five of them. Ah, oh, there might be, or actually there might be more who we need. I don't think you can kill them. Well, I, you probably technically, like, technically can kill them. But I don't think killing them gets you, you know, stuff. Well, not stuff, it gets you through. Thank you, stick. Thank you, stick. And I'm gonna break you, Iceman. Just for all the trouble you caused me in the ice temple place. Even though I'm not sure if you even really bothered me at all. I just want you to know I hate you. Um, more Kabitos. Which way should we take? Oh, fuck. Also, watch out. There's a uh, wall masters in this level. I always thought that was weird that wall masters are the ones that fall from the ceiling. I mean, floor masters make sense because they're on the floor. But shouldn't they be like ceiling ma- I guess ceiling masters sound stupid. <laughs> Making up the rules of video games as we go along. And once again, he's probably going to take all of these Deku nuts. Uh, this, this, I bear you no remorse. And let's walk in here. Man, it's dark in here. Oh shit. What the fuck? Oh, that's cool. Hey, bugs. Hmm. There's probably, um. Oh, I get it. Maybe. You'll probably need to come back here and grab items like the bugs and maybe water from that other thing. But, um. What I grab might be just be what we needed to get through. I always remember this part being really, really weird. Because you need to grab all the stuff. Leave it, leave it. Leave me something warm that can melt ice and quench one's spirits. Um, melt ice and quench one's spirits. That'd be like fire. I, mean, I don't want to get my fire. I'm just fucking... Apple. Melt fire and... Melt, melt fire. <laughs> melt ice and quench with some water. Duh. Wait, melt ice with water? I'm confused. Let me go check what he said again. Warm that can melt ice and quench one's spirits. Warm water. So probably we'll find some like hot spring water later. Unless that was hot spring water. Ten refreshing blasts. You find bombs to be refreshing? Okay. Whatever floats your boat, because you're gonna die, because you're... I like how they get the stuff, and they're like, huh, I'm happy, and then they disappear. But you don't get the item back. Oh, this is a nice room to be in. Bunch of spinning blades. What do we get to fight? What do we get to fight? I'll kick its ass. Oh, it's just, just a big Poe. <laughs> Come after me, it's a real enemy game. Um, after saying that, I realized. Oh, yeah, you just shoot it with arrows. Yeah, Poe's are not too bad. And then we'll probably want to catch it in our bottle afterwards. Because it's just like an Ocarina of Time. You hey, ass fuck. You catch them in your bottles, and one of these Gabitos probably wants this, which is why it has an entire room dedicated to it. 
Ah, so when it spins, you can't hit it with your sword. No, 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 no. I mean, it can't. You can't hit it with arrows, so you probably can't hit it with your sword either. I'm gonna hit that fucker with my sword. Why not? Yeah, it doesn't work. Oh well, it's probably gonna die soon. If I'm lucky. As you can see, I'm zooming in a well, not zooming in, but targeting a lot in hopes of hitting him. There we go. Yeah. Come to me, big pose soul. And if we have to, we'll ditch the uh, we'll ditch the fairy. Come here. There we go. Big Poe. Makes sense, big Poe. Are there normal? Yeah, there, I'm pretty sure there's normal Poes in this game. They probably included them in this area. Oh lord. I was just thinking, like, oh, maybe I have to stand in the center of the room and play the uh, the Song of Discovery, but that's Spirit Tracks. I've been recently. I've been replaying Spirit Tracks. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I like Spirit Tracks. I think they did a nice job with it. Although it could do with better, either better flute controls or rework those flute, uh, those flute areas. Those fucking parts. I hated those. Do I have an empty bottle? No, I used it. Yeah. What do you want, Yubito? Leave it, leave it. Leave me something deliciously fresh. Milk? I don't want to give him the milk and he drinks it. Is there... How do you get the... Here, um, let me look at the description. How do you... Info, here we go. Freshly caught while jumping. Cole, we'll come back to you. Oh lord. <laughs> I love how we can kill him in one hit. I like this sword. They drop quite a lot of loot. So that's always nice. Use the fairy. It's always a shame to use a fairy before you have to die. I guess it's not as bad as using a life shroom in Paper Mario before it's necessary. But... Let's see what happens if we give him the water. Maybe he'll give us a better hint then, so we don't give him like our milk or our fish. Because I'm thinking that's what it is, it's either the milk or the fish. Let's see what happens if we're wrong. If you're wrong, he doesn't take it, okay. So we can keep guessing at it till we get it right. It's just like Phoenix right, all over again. Hey wait, no, I wanted to give you something. I don't know about you guys, but... Well, that's probably how most people play, unless you're insanely good. Just where you present evidence at random until you get it right. I ended up doing that a lot because I would think something else is going on, but it was never that thing. Is the fish deliciously fresh? Yes, it is the fish. Oh well. I'm so glad they don't take your items. Because that would be a mean thing to do. A very mean thing to do. Oh. Nuts. Hmm. I guess they do supply with some of the things. There'll probably be like a cow just somewhere in here. Damn, then it's really dark in here. Hmm. Maybe it, it lights up as you give them items. Maybe. Leave me something small and creepy. Oh, he wants a bug. The bugs are in those other rooms. So we'll come back to you later. What does you want? Leave it, leave it, leave me a ghost, a big one at that. Ah, I was right. We were gonna need a big ghost. That's a shame, because I think, uh, you can sell the ghosts for, um, no, the big pose in the curiosity shop for quite a good price. Oh no, pose. Or, not pose, but. What are these things called? Bow. Oh, I see. Creative naming. Are you fuckers still alive? Nope, nope, nope. Alright, let's go get um, bug guys and bugs. That's how they shall be referred to by what they want. This is the bug room. Oh, whoops. Almost got hit by. Well, why, why would I say whoops? 
Whoops, I almost got hit by fire. My bad. Roll. I'm always afraid, um... Well, not always afraid. But when I'm wearing the Gabito mask, I just feel vulnerable to fire. The bandages and all. Even though I'm not a Gabito. Kind of like the same way you would be if you were wearing a Deku mask. Give me something small and creepy. Well, here's my dick! Oh. That made me sad. Oh well. Self burnt. What the fuck? Oh. I was about to, I was like, everything's weird. Invisible. Of course. And we'll do what we do to all invisible things shoot arrows at them. And that's why no one will ever find a ghost. Because we shoot fucking arrows at them when we see them. This room's empty. So let's light up. We'll light up the night. The night being this room. Wait, I have Deku sticks this time. I can. I can Deku stick it for once. Hell yeah! Hey. Oh. I'll need to do two of them? What happens if I do the other two? I guess it just makes the room brighter. Oh well, what do we get out of this? Oh, 50 rubies, that's nice. I guess I can forgive you for not giving me the money I would have earned if you would have let me keep the Poland. Oh. I almost forgot about those. Holy shit. Let's keep, keep, keep. There we go. Um... Yeah, I don't know if anyone else has, like, a tactic for those guys, but that's normally what I do whenever I get them on me. Is either run around in circles, or just keep moving until they fall and then kill them. Because after they fall, um, they kind of stay away for a little bit. Ha! Fitting in. Killing our... ourselves, killing each other. I always think lighting up these torches is gonna give me a prize. I like prizes. Oh, hey, hey. Oh, I guess you're the last Gabito. Yeah, see, they'll stay away for a while, but then they come back. These are you guys drop a pretty penny, so. This is probably a nice place to come to to grind for money. Um, rich in calcium. Calcium? You mean. water! But I'll try the milk anyways. Ah, calcium. Looks so good. I probably have like so much calcium in my body that I'm going to die. Die of over calciumifying myself. Hmm. Um, let's do the same thing as we always do. Well, not the same thing as we always do, because I'm going to take the Gabito mask off. Because I think we're out of the Gabito zone. Help, I'm stepping into the Gabito zone. There we go. Yes. Yes. And this is just what we needed out of here. Just what I needed. Let's see what we get. I love how this game does like the items you get before the dungeon. I think that's kind of cool. The mirror shield! It looks nothing like the mirror shield from the other game, but this mirror shield fits in this game so well. Just look how creepy it looks. It has a fucking face on it. Ah, I love the mirror shield. Shine the light, which shines that creepy fucking face. And um, you're gonna need to remember those faces, those sun faces, because that's going to be a lot of the puzzles. A lot of the puzzles are going to involve the mirror shield in this next dungeon. Because it just mirrors that entire wall missing. Huh. That's funny. Do we really go through that entire area? Huh. I always remember the well being much bigger. I guess I remember the well from Ocarina of Time being much bigger as well, but I guess everything's larger as a kid. Also, I'm from Texas, so everything's big. 
so everything's small in comparison. <laughs> um, let's get our standard item select up. Um, there, there we go. 